Greetings Earthlings, how is it going? This is Tyler from iOS Planet and today I'm doing a top 5 guns you should not purchase in Pixel Gun 3D video. Uh, disclaimer, I did not come up with this idea, I have seen multiple YouTubers make this video, so I don't take credit for coming up with this video idea, but I wanted to throw my opinion in there with some guns that I believe you should not buy that I have purchased <laughs> mistakenly, uh, so I just want to warn you guys about them. Uh, all of this is my personal opinion, so if I mention your favorite gun and you don't like that, don't crucify me too much, you know, uh, uh, no, I, uh, it's all personal opinion. So, jumping into the video, we have the plasma rifle, we have the flower power, we have the pig hammer, we have the razor thrower, and the wizard wand. All five of these weapons you should not purchase in Pixel Gun 3D, uh, not because... You know, there are a lot of coins, because actually they're pretty cheap. But I'm going to be pointing out the flaws in them in some gameplay. So we're going to jump in. A lot of people don't like me playing Nuclear City, but I just play it because it's very populated and I never get any like empty em empty lobbies. Uh, it's always pretty much full. So we're going to jump into Nuclear City, and I'm going to break these guns down, tell you why you should not purchase them. That is kind of loud. So, the game actually may end, it looks like, yeah, there's only a minute left, so we're gonna start out with the Plasma Rifle. This gun, you know, isn't, it takes three to kill, um, and I wouldn't say it's that bad, you know, three bullets isn't bad for killing someone, but, uh, you know, it's not bullets, so it doesn't get to them fast, like, they can dodge them, they can easily dodge them, actually, plus, we have the Crystal Armor, which, obviously, uh, it's taking a lot of bullets, uh, to, uh, try to kill them. Um, you know, I don't even, I, I, I don't even know. He, crystal armor with a wand, it's just, you can't, can't really, can't really do anything. Uh, but I would not recommend this gun to anyone. I believe it looks really cool. Uh, I like the concept of it. Uh, and the idea of it. But again, the bullets don't get to the person until some amount of time. Uh, so it ends up being kind of bad, because they can dodge them, they can just do whatever, plus when they have crystal armor, it does, it does do some damage, or it does, like, um, it does hinder you even more from getting the kill, so overall, I just don't believe you should purchase this weapon. Um, it's not too expensive if you're just trying to purchase all of the guns, but if you're trying to look for something good, I would not even bother with this one. So, this guy has crystal armor. I don't believe I can kill him anyway, so we're just going to stop there and pull out the flower power. Now, the flower power is actually better than it was when it first released, uh, because I believe this got a really big buff on it. Um, I think without armor, it's actually one shot. Uh, but it's kind of, kind of difficult to aim, uh, plus at a distance, it's really easy for people to dodge it. Uh, but, as you see there, I got a kill. I don't know if I can kill that now. He's magic wanding it up. Uh, but the flower power isn't as bad as you used to be. But in my personal opinion, uh, I wouldn't purchase it. It's only... I think it's 85 coins, so it's not that expensive. Um, but I just don't believe it is worth purchasing. I mean, there are a lot of other secondaries that you can purchase that uh, are better than this. Now, again... They did upgrade this, they did buff it, so it is like one shot, but at a distance, it's pretty much not, it's not really good. Uh, I like the concept of it, I don't like the way they changed it, uh, I mean, I like the way that they changed it from pink, but it, it they kind of put like a Christmas, Christmas color onto it, and I don't really like that. I mean, if it's just like gray or something, I don't know, the colors of it I don't really like anymore. Well, I didn't like it to begin with, but I don't like the change, uh, but it is... It's a decent gun, but I just wouldn't recommend purchasing it in Pixel Gun 3D. Just save your coins, little fellas. Save your coins. So we're going to go on to the melee. We're going to use the uh, pig hammer, I believe it's called. Now the pig hammer... I don't even know what to say about this. First of all... It oinks. It oinks when you swing it. <laughs> also... For the coins, uh, I believe this one may be like 85 coins, something like that, but it's definitely nowhere near worth it. 
uh, because there's things that are so much more powerful than this, and it's just not even good. I don't even know if I can find anybody, because everybody's, like, sitting with wands and whatnot, and I don't, I just don't even know anymore, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> but, uh, I am trying to get to somebody to show you guys. I, I believe it takes, like, three hits to kill somebody. I may be completely wrong with that, but, I don't know, I just, I find the oinking annoying. I find it looking really ugly with this big, you know, pink fat hammer type thing i just i don't like it i don't like the look of it i don't like the oinking because it's annoying um just overall i don't can i can i try to kill oh i did kill him yes <laughs> uh but i mean i i just don't i don't like it i wouldn't recommend it to anybody really um so i guess we'll go on to the razor thrower thing um <clears throat> this thing is not too bad but for, what's it called, a special? Yeah, ooh, there's so many things that are way better uh, than this in the special. Uh, throwing in the crystal armor, once you have crystal armor, this thing is pretty, pretty bad. Um, <clears throat> but it only has nine bullets. Uh, it is okay, but again, I would not uh, recommend it. All of these people are trying to have a no-kill lobby, but, you know, I don't know. <laughs> This is Pixel Gun. This isn't no, isn't no uh, social network. No. <laughs> but um, it's not too bad, but, I mean, for specials, there are a lot more things that are uh, a lot more powerful that you could purchase. So, um, But it is a really cool gun, but I just, I just would say no deal. No deal to this one. Uh, let's see if I can get this guy, and then we'll go on to the last one. We did get him, actually. Ooh, ooh, can we get the, can we get the double? Oh, this thing shoots pretty fast. Got him. Okay. Anyway, we're going to the... I believe this is just called the Magic Wand. Now, for premium. This is a premium slot. This is taking up a premium slot. Now, for the premiums, you can have the prototype, the Elephant Hunter. You can have that one-shot wand, which I really despise. I would not recommend buying that because you would make me mad instantly. <laughs> um, but, 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 uh, this thing... I mean, again, it's a Magic Wand, so you don't have ammo so if you don't have that many coins but you find yourself running out of ammo pretty quickly and you need something to just kinda make up for that you know you could get the magic wand I just would not recommend it to anyone I would say do not purchase this gun ever in pixel gun 3d unless you're just trying to collect all the guns uh, if you want a magic gun use I mean if you want a magic weapon use the uh, dark mage wand I believe it's called but that one's like 300 coins <laughs> but um, I just wouldn't use this one uh, it is just a waste of like 85 coins or 65 I think it may be 65 you know just save that stuff it's really hard to hit people um, it doesn't kill them with one hit it's like three two or three so overall it's just I wouldn't recommend it um, I would say never buy this gun in Pixel Gun 3D. Uh, but again, this is all personal opinion. This is not fact. This is, I'm not saying do it. Again, if I mentioned any of your favorite weapons, um, you know, don't get too mad at me. Uh, it's all my opinion. <clears throat> so, if you, if you're newer to the game and you're seeing all these guns and they look cool, uh, these are just five that I would say do not purchase. <laughs> So, um, if you enjoyed the video, if this helped you in any way, definitely drop a like. Subscribe for more iOS gaming videos if you're new. Welcome. I uh, do Pixel Gun videos, Minecraft videos, occasional scary games, and then random other apps. So, if you enjoy any of those, definitely subscribe. All my social networks will be in the description. So, uh, go stay connected with me by following me on those. And, um... Pretty much that's it. In the comments down below, tell me a gun that you regret buying and or you uh, a one that I didn't list in here that you want to warn people about not to purchase. You can leave those in the comments down below, but uh, mainly just tell me what guns you've purchased that uh, you wouldn't recommend to anyone. That is just a plain mistake, waste of coins. Uh, leave those in the comments down below. Anyway, guys, that was pretty much it, guys. Again, if you enjoyed, drop a like, but that, that was it. This is Tyler from iOS Planet. I will see you guys later.